was, yes, dramatic world events unfolding right before our own eyes is taking place, you guys. Are we running out of time? Is time up? Mm. The world is spinning out of control super fast as if it was stronger than a hurricane. I said that. So many things is happening so fast and quickly than ever before in history, you guys. And so many events has taken place as well. So let's go over some of the things that has taken place, some of the events and stuff. Ben Benjamin uh, Yahoo, the prime minister in Israel, was re-elected at the last minute. 1159, I believe. The sun, the blood moon, the blood, the bloody moon, um, the blood in the seas and the rivers has taken place. Mass animal deaths worldwide has been taking place. And whew, I'm telling you, what for real? This is crazy. The um, the Islam threats and attacks worldwide taking place, and them beheading and burning Christians. People getting imprisonated because of their fate these days. The floating cities in this in the sky that has been seen in China. The solar flares, the asteroid, um, the Pakistan and Israel conflict and the Russia and Turkey conflict, the shooting down warplanes. Well, uh War on ter uh, terrorism, threats, and attacks everywhere is taking place in these very last days, you guys. Um, on each other as well. War on the people. Why do I say that? Our religious freedom, because of their race, because our freedom of speech, just because of everything you can think of in these last days. The Pope, Pope Francis, uh, when he visited the, the Union, when he was here in the, the U.S., what did he say? Failure on, uh, Jesus failed on the cross and the hour has come. And he blessed the new world, for a new world order. Well, for, first of all, well, let me tell you, Jesus did not, he did not fail on that cross. He died on that cross and did the right thing so you would be saved in his name. So you could be saved. So let's get that right. The Pope, talk, it, it talks about, uh, I think it's uh, Revelation chapter 13. The false prophet is the Pope. Go check it out. Okay, um, so we have Israel sells the Jerusalem to the Vicodin. Mm. And the Pope has a seat at King David's tomb. 2013, this was established. The U.S. president is laughed by all nations and mocked, you guys. Food shortages worldwide has taken place. Protests, massive shootings, home invasions, earthquakes, landslides, um, sinkholes, mountains moving. The things the Bible talks about, about the signs, you guys. Um... Massive uh, wildfires taking place. Robots um, turning into humans. They're making them into humans. Cloning humans. Implanting uh, humans with chips. To track our every movement. To know what we are doing. And, and they can also tr detect what is, is in your house. You know, I've done my research on that stuff as well. But anyways, you guys. All these things is taking place that we are living um in the last days and time is up and we're running out of time for real we are running out of time let's get into acts chapter 2 verse 19 and 20 real quick and i will show wonders in heaven above and signs in the earth beneath blood and fire and vapor of smoke 20. The sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before that great and noble day of the Lord come. The signs tell us where we're at and where we stand. And we are running out of time. These are the last days and we are running out of time. If you were not saved in the name of Jesus, get, get to know who Jesus is and be saved in the name of Jesus, you guys.